So with Christmas being over and the youngest getting so many Lego sets this year, I figured it's time to make a Lego sorter for all our existing Legos. So we can kind of see what we have for pieces wise and everything. Pieces wise? Pieces? Yeah, I guess that's right, pieces wise. Oh no, long dog. There's a lid for it. And then, you see, it just gets smaller and smaller. So, I have yet to try it out. I've been waiting to make a video to try it out. Here, check this out. This is going to be a blast from the past, too. This is my wife's from when she was younger. Look at this. even says, works with Lego. I don't think you see that on anything anymore. I don't think they do collabs like that. Well, I guess they do because there's a there's a Hot Wheels Lego that the boy has that you can actually you build the motor and stuff on it, and it's uh, and it's Lego. Oof, the hairs. There's a full cow in there. Oh, I just seen the Joker. Let's see how it's turning out. So, okay. Let's go a little further down. Okay. Oh, the hair, man, the hair. Oh. All right, we got a couple guys in there, not so many. Oh yeah, we definitely got guys all the way on the bottom now. All right. Oh, good looking. Well, that definitely is not a normal Lego block size. That's a uh, one block up, I think. All right, let's see what we got here. All right, there's one layer. So next, see a couple in there that could still probably go through. Some of those could probably still go through, I would guess, probably because there's a lot in there. Oh, look at that Ninja Turtle head. Ninja Turtle head. And then you got, yeah, ugh, and all the hair. Oh, I got the hair. Hands, everything else. Oh, seem to work fairly well. I just need something to dump them in sizes so I could keep sifting. It's like when you get to these higher level ones, it's getting kind of full, you know. So I need to dump these out so I can sift some different sizes. Or simply break these up and get things out of it that's not Legos. And then when they're empty, you could stack them all on top of each other and throw the lid on. And it's a nice compact little system. Yeah. You just got tubs and tubs of Legos like I do. And you're trying to actually do something with them to maybe build something. This is definitely the way to go. Uh, easy 3D print.